Good evening, Alan Cheryl. Still an ongoing investigation by both the Elgin Police Department and the Chicago Police Department. But as you mentioned, those two people were held here inside of this apartment complex behind me after they were kidnapped in the Elgin area. They escaped this morning, though, running down Grand Avenue, handcuffed together. An off-duty officer observed a male and a female handcuffed together running down the street. A man and a woman handcuffed together inside of this apartment finally escape from their kidnapper. After police say the two had been held captive by a 41-year-old man inside of an apartment in the 6200 block of West Grand Avenue. The off-duty officer pulled over, had a conversation with the pair and learned that they had been kidnapped and were being held against their will. An off-duty Chicago cop calling 911 for backup. I'm going to call him a person calling for help. 6305 West on Grand. Says a female Hispanic and a male Hispanic in handcuffs. They say they need help. They were kidnapped. They're running westbound. Chicago police say the victims, who are both adults, were kidnapped in the suburbs and then taken to the apartment in the Belmont Cragen neighborhood. Investigators have not yet said how long they'd been inside, but this morning they finally saw a chance to escape and took off running to a nearby store. The owner of that store tells ABC7 the duo stayed inside while investigators entered the apartment to look for more victims. That's when neighbors tell me they heard gunshots. We heard a lot of shots go off and a lot of commotion. Across the street. During the confrontation, the offender was shot and killed by a CPD officer. Detectives found this gun inside of the apartment, but have not yet said if the man was holding the weapon at the time of the shooting. Right now, police working to figure out why these two were being held in the first place. And we just got new information in from the Elgin Police Department, who's still working on this developing story. They do tell us that the suspect who was shot and killed inside of this apartment complex behind me was known to those two victims who took off running down the street. They say this was not a random incident. The three all knew each other. So we're waking, working, uh, working to get more information on that. We can tell you that the Elgin Police and Chicago Police are working together on this investigation. They're asking anyone, though, with information to give them a call. The Chicago Police officer who shot and killed that suspect remains unpaid administrative leave during this ongoing investigation. We're live in the Belmont Cragen neighborhood. I'm Alexis McAdams, ABC 7 Eyewitness News.